A delightful Friday for round two of this, the 102nd New Zealand Open from Central Otago, New Zealand. The breezes would kick up and the scoring would be just a little bit different than it was in day one. Steve Elko would take dead aim. Coming off of the bogey at eight, this is approached at nine. Elka would make that one and close with a 70 and finish the day at seven under. This is Kozuma-san off the Japanese tour, his eagle attempt from long range at the 11th, the par five. He'd knock it down on route to a 68 okay. and be well positioned at seven under. Kazuma Kabori, the amateur from Christchurch. He'd be pouring him in from all over the show. Kabori would make that to get to eight under and draw within four. Jay Wong Yum off the Asian tour, a little chipping from the edge of the green at the third would have him join the crew at eight under par and just a few shots back. The veteran off the Asian tour, Scott Hend, a 10 time champ, puts himself right in the mix with this birdie at the eighth. He'd shoot 64 on Friday. Shaywalls Cobb, the young Australian, playing nicely, stiffing iron shots and knocking down the putts en route to a 64 as well, would have him on his way to 12 under par heading into the weekend. But it'd be Christopher Wood come up the 61 on Thursday. The putter was still hot on Friday. He dropped that one at 15. He started on 10 to get to 12 under. He'd make a couple of more birdies, but this would be his approach to the fifth, finishing up on the front side. He would knock that one down to get to 15 under. However, close with a couple of bogeys. He's the man to catch over the weekend. Christopher Wood at the New Zealand Open.